How's it going? It's Bill the Handyman up here in Northern California. Today we're looking at a Kenmore. We're going to swap a motor. So this one, the motor kind of grunts a little bit too much, more than we'd like. And so we're going to take this apart. And there's a disclaimer for you. And we're going to take it apart and then put another motor in it. So first thing I need to do is I'm going to pull that wind filter out, take these two screws off, and then we'll stick a flathead screwdriver in here and we can pull this up. And that'll go back. And next thing we're going to do is take these screws out here. They're nuts. There and there. You got to be careful with this wire. We don't want to break it. And we're going to disconnect it from here. And then we're going to leave that wire connected and then open the door up, take the drum out, take the belt out off, and um, take the motor out, and then swap it. Okay. We got it out. And so here's how I pull these motors off. I take this little spring clip off the back here. Um, and I leave that one on, that front clip, till I got it loose. And sometimes it's good to warm these things up a little bit before you even attempt this, because these blowers on the back of this motor can be on there pretty tight. And ideally, you'd want to use like a crescent wrench or a box stand wrench to grab that mo that uh, that blower on the back. And so you can see I have this resting up against here. So all I have to do is pull this, and that will come loose. So this one I already had loose, so uh, yours may be quite a bit tighter. And so if uh, if it's like super tight, and you end up stripping this nut here, uh, that blower basically has a nut. It's a plastic Teflon whatever nut on it. You end up breaking that or, you know, boogering it up so much that you can't take the motor off. You're going to have to take the back off and then replace that blower uh, and bust that blower off and then replace it with another blower. But once you get this thing loose, you can notice this is unscrewing the, once you have this uh, stationary, this way is unscrewing the blower. And once you have it kind of unscrewed, you can take this other clip off. Make sure it's all the way unscrewed from that blower. 